nice song, We Can Be Heroes. Well, good evening, Sumter School District boys and girls, and welcome to another evening of reading with the superintendent. Tonight, I'm excited, as I always am, but even more excited because I have a very special guest joining us this evening. Miss Selena Ruth Smith will be joining us. Good evening, Miss Smith. How are you? I'm well, wonderful, fabulous, fierce. I am great. How you doing, Superintendent? I'm great, and I'm excited to have you join me this evening. Why don't you take the opportunity to introduce yourself for those who don't know who you are? Many do, but some don't. So take the opportunity to introduce yourself, please. Thank you. My name is Selena Ruth Smith. I'm a big metropolis of Maysville, South Carolina, where I am a Sumter School District graduate, 1994, of Maywood High School. And I currently work for the Sumter South Carolina Fire Department, and I bring you greetings from Chief Paul Ford, Assistant Chief Bernie Dollar, and Assistant Chief Brian Christmas. So that's a little bit of who I am. Been a firefighter for 13 years, and I love it. Great, and you do a wonderful job, particularly as it pertains to having your hands on our children within the community. So I just want to publicly thank you for all that you do. So this evening, boys and girls, we'll be reading a book with Miss Smith called Say Something. Hmm, let's think about that, Say Something. So without further ado, I'm going to turn it over to Miss Smith who's going to read, but before we begin, make sure we're focused and we're ready and we're attentive. One, two, three, all eyes on me. One, two, all eyes on you. Miss Smith, the floor is yours. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This book, Say Something, is very important, and we don't have to always have a voice to say something. You can say something with our actions and with our words. So without further ado, let's say something. It says, you don't have to be loud. I think that's nice if you see someone, especially in school, if they're new, it'll help invite them into the environment. I think that's a very good recommendation. That's right, something strong. If you see an empty canvas, say something with your brush. So you're showing your artistry. That's right, steam. The A in steam is for arts. If you see an empty lot, Say something by planting a seed and watching it bloom. If you see someone being hurt, say something by being brave. Hey, stop. That's almost like bullying. When you see someone being bullied, if you stand by and watch, you're just as guilty as the person who's bullying. That's right. Something strong is anti-bullying. If you see something beautiful, Say something with a poem. I can say something because I know our children in Sumter School District are beautiful. Beautiful, especially with their sight words. If you have a brilliant idea, say something with confidence. Eureka! If you want to show the world who you are, say something with style. And I like if you say something with style. It goes back to the first page that you read where it says you don't have to be loud to get your point across. You can be soft-spoken. And so the ta-da is actually showing what you have to offer. That's right. If you are angry, say something to help people understand. You may be feeling visible that really hurt. <laughs> so expressing your feelings. You see it just to say something peacefully. It's better others to do the same. No more, no more hurting people. Peace. Being a good role model, just like you. We try. We definitely try. Keep saying it. And you may be surprised to find that the whole world is listening. If you are for being alive, 
something to the stars, to the universe. I do that often. Some people find it easier to say something than others. But everyone has something to say. I hope, I believe, join us. I wish. Together we can. I'm ready to change the world. I met. Well, you know, there is a lot of meaning in that book, Say Something, and I hope that all of our viewers are able to say something, something that encourages, influences, and supports, but more importantly, demonstrates who you are. Ms. Smith, thank you so much for that book reading. I was excited to uh, share it, and thank y'all so much. So I'm going to say something, something strong. Something strong. Thank you, Miss Smith. Thank you again, and I hope to see you very soon, and maybe we can do this again. Likewise, likewise. So boys and girls, it's time for you to get ready for bed. Thank you again for joining us. We'll see you tomorrow, and remember, say something. Good night. I like the meaning of this song too, we can be heroes.